Wow, congratulations to us guys, congratulations to us guys. We just hit 4k subscribers. Our channel got hit 4k subscribers. Guys, I'm so grateful to you. Oh, I could not have done this without it. Oh, I could not have done it on my own. I'm so grateful. Thank you guys for following me. Please keep on supporting the channel as I keep on bringing powerful strategies to make money from the uh, from the synthetic industry markets. Thank you guys for this. Let's watch this video and see our last strategy to make profits. Just look at this. Look at this. Look at this. All these are profits. All these are profits I've made. Look at it. Look at this, guys. Look at this. How I've caught several spikes on boom and also on crash. Look at this. I sold crash. That's I caught the, 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 the crash. The drops. I caught them. I caught the spikes on boom. Okay. I also caught this move on um, VIX. Well, that's it's a 10 index. Look at this. I caught multiple spikes using a very simple strategy that I'm going to share with you guys now. Look at this. I have um, about. I have um, this trade running. I have one. It's in profit. I have two. Profit. I have three. Profit. So I have these trades. Then the fourth one, which is this one. That is it. And it's in profit as well. So I have all these trades running. Boom. 500 crash. 500. For that 25 and for that 30, um, 10 index, and I'm going to show you all these things how I was able to catch all these trades using simple strategy, very simple strategy. That look at it using this simple strategy that is very easy for anybody to learn, even a beginner. Okay, so I'm going to share all of them in different videos today. I'll be showing you how I was able to catch the spikes on boom and crash. Okay, I'm going to show you how I was able to catch the spikes on boom and crash. Meanwhile, look at this long move. Look at this long move. How I was able to catch this long trend. Oh my goodness, man. Look at it. So I'm going to share all this strategy with you guys. If you want to get these um, strategies on how I got all these profitable trades make sure you like this video make sure you subscribe to this channel and turn on the post notification by the bell icon click on it and check the description box you see a link to my telegram channel just make sure you join that you click the link and join the telegram channel so that whenever i make any of these videos and drop it you get notified you'll be able to see it okay so i want this trade to close i want it to hit our, our, our trailing stop and close Look at it, it's going to hit our trailing stop because I've been trailing the stop. I've been trailing the price, right? It's going to hit our trailing stop here and it will close. It's going to hit it and close. It's going to hit our trailing stop and close. Boom, it has happened, right? Just hit our trailing stop and you can see the trades have closed. The trades have closed. So I'm going to share with you guys how I was able to achieve this. I want to show how to catch spikes like massive. Oh my god, like massively. This is a powerful strategy you need not joke with. Make sure you stick to the rules. I'm going to show you guys. This is a bonus for all the support people have been giving this channel. And today we have gotten to 4k. Um 4k subscribers now this is um boom 500 i'm going to show you how to catch spikes take notes we have this moving average this one and the stochastic oscillator right these are the only indicators you need for this strategy these are the only indicators you need and i'm going to show you the setups along the line so stay with me now the first rule, the first thing you do whenever you come to the market after having your chart set like this, the first thing to do is go to the five minutes time frame. Go to the five minutes time frame. As you come to the five minutes time frame like this, the thing you want to do again is ask yourself, where did I see a crossover? That is what I want you to do. Where are you seeing a crossover? Okay. The same thing works on the um, 1000 as well. So any of them, you can use it. Any of the boom and crash, you can use it. Okay. So you want to ask yourself, where am I seeing a crossover or cross below in this, um, um, what do you call it? In this instrument, I want to trade. 
okay that's the first thing you want to ask of now pay close attention guys pay rapt attention now after you have seen it okay let me let me wipe off these things so that we'll have a clean chart so yeah after you have asked yourself that then you want to see for instance this is this one we have it is the five minutes um uh, okay this is it here the five minutes time frame remember i want to show you how to catch spikes this is the five minutes time frame and then we've got a crossover here good the first condition has been met we've seen a crossover right the next thing you want to do is scale down to the, the to the um, one minute time frame scale to the one minute time frame this is the one minute time frame now go back to that place i'm just back testing so i'll go back to that place where we had that crossover this is it okay this is where we had that crossover so what do i want to do first thing i want to see is i want to see price come to the over sold level this is my stochastic my stochastic oscillator rather i want to see come to the oversold level anything from this 20 level yeah this is our 20 level and this is the line sorry the line is too faint i'm supposed to increase it for you guys but i believe you can see it now anything below this um 50, 20 level is our oversold level then anything above this 80 level is our overbought level now you want to see the stochastic oscillator come to the oversold level once it is within the oversold level the next thing you want to do is you want to wait for price to come down in between this um orange line orange colored line and this um green colored line once price comes in between them you take a buy immediately remember you want to catch spike you want to catch spike or spikes now you take a buy you open a, a buy position this is where you place your stop loss below this previous candle here that's where you place your stop loss now guys look at what happened you caught the spike very easy very easy if it's very easy i want you to tell me in the comment box is it easy tell me in the comment box let me know but if it's difficult tell me it's difficult in the comment box and i will explain better now look at this one the same thing happened again when you catch this one you take your profits you don't want you don't want um this 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 drawdown this stuff here to take away some of your profits you want to just be catching them you are scalping now you want to just catch them and leave immediately then as it comes back here especially as soon as it gets to this 50 you put another trade right you put another one and then you place your stop loss here below this candle then you take your buy immediately look at this it spiked and overtook this one overtook the top here so as soon as you get that you close your trade and you are out right then just the same thing you keep repeating guys look at it i want to show you these things i want to show you it's it's very simple guys some people might not be telling you this but those who are free my mentorship um class know that i always give them very easy to use strategy that have made them profit uh, uh, in the market now look at this again price came to the over sold level this is it over sold level then you open the trade here this is it, where we open the trade here because it came to the um green indicator then you, you took a buy and you can see what happened you can see what happened you can see what happened here then you close again look at it anytime price came back to the indicators and the moving the um obstacles oscillator was below the 20 level you can see just keep buying just keep buying that is it it's so simple look at it again look at it here price still came um what do i what, do I, what, what, what am i saying this stochastic later came to came below the 20 level right that is the oversold level then price came to this green candle this time um, green moving average ladder and then you take a buy you can see it and then look at it very long spike what a massive profit 
So guys, that is just how it works. It's as simple as that. It's as simple as that. You keep making money using this strategy. It's so easy, guys. So like this video and turn the post notification bell. I'm going to show you guys how I was able to take the other one, the other trades that gave me all this other profit. I was, I was able to catch all this. Move. Look at, just take a look at this move. Guys, take a look at this move. This is it. This is where I bought this one. Using a particular strategy. I'm going to share the strategy in the next video. Look at it. Look at it. Look at it. Wow. See, much like on the on this video, then I'll make a video how I caught this long spike. Um, this long move. And then I will share the um I'll share it with you guys on this YouTube. Thank you guys for watching. Please like, subscribe, and share to your friends. Okay, and join our um telegram channel. The link is in the description box. Now, how do you set up this um um indicators? How do you set up these indicators? This is it. This is how you set up this indicator. The first time moving average 50 is the period. Then the method is exponential. Apply to close style is four pixel and um green color. You can choose any color of your choice. The next one is 20 period moving average. The color is orange, that is the difference. Every other thing exponential close four pixel. Just <laughs> that to click done. The next one is the stochastic oscillator. This is it. You can see. K period 5, D period 3, slowing 3, price feeds, low and high, uh, method simple and all that. So simple guys, so simple, so simple. Then you come to level, click level, then you see it's 80, 20. Okay, this is the reason why the line was faint, so let me increase it. I like it here, like this, let me increase it. Good. So this is it, done can see if you go back you are going to see that light line is now thick right it's 20 and the 80 lines are now thicker and easier to see so that is it thank you guys for watching this is the alpha trade and as i always say it can only get better